if you can. for Miss Smiley's summer show. What do you think, Mum? Oh, it's beautiful, Jemima. Just then, Uncle CJ arrived home. Right, that's Grandpa settled in the cafe with his mates. And Grandpa was having a great time at his Young at Hearts Club. Can't wait for your summer show tonight, Miss Smiley. Oh, I hope I'm ready in time. And we've got a guest of honour, remember? Oh, yes. You'll never guess who's going to be in the audience. He's staying at the mill. Yes, there was a new guest staying at the mill. And he was... Cheery Charlie Cheekster. Only he didn't seem very cheery. You don't look very cheery, Charlie. Well, it's just being back in Sunny Sands, you know, where I used to perform when I was young, singing and dancing at the theatre and on the pier. Grandma says that people came from miles around to see you. Those were the days. But it's all over, you see. Now I've just come back to Sunny Sands to sit in the audience and watch. But Sunny Sands is so pleased to have you back. Really? Oh, it's absolutely. Of course. Yes, this was Cheery Charlie Cheekster's big return. <laughs> At that moment, Jemima came upstairs. Hi, Mr. Cheekster. I'm Jemima. Hello. Grandpa's always talking about you. Wow, what have you got here? This is a, a Cheery Charlie Cheekster doll. I looked just like that. <laughs> <laughs> so handsome. Grandpa will be thrilled to meet you. He remembers all your songs. I heard him singing one of your songs only yesterday. That's right, CJ. Now, how did it go? This is how it'll always be. You're the only thing I see. I'll get down on bended knee and tell you that you're the one for me. Oh, you make my heart go pitty pitty pat. Just like that. Pitty pitty pat, yes, every time I see you it goes pitty pitty pat Cos you're the one for me <laughs> But Charlie just said... I don't remember, I'm afraid. Oh, oh you make my heart... Grandpa go remembered, and so did his friends. Pitty pitty pat. <laughs> <laughs> but Cheery Charlie really wasn't as Grandpa remembered him. Well, I've got to get to the beach hut to sort out some bike hire. And I'll go and get lunch ready. Jemima, Jason, Grandpa used to sing you one of Charlie's songs. Why don't you remind him of it? Um... Do you remember this, Charlie? When the dark clouds are forming and the rain pours down Don't get sad, just let your sorrows drown Cos the clouds will pass and take away your frown And the sun will start shining in Came downstairs. We heard singing. Wow! <laughs> Always smile when the sun is shining. Always laugh and never cry. Every cloud has a silver lining when the sun starts shining in the sky. We thought Jason and Jemima were great, but it hadn't cheered Charlie up. No. You're still young, you see. You can have fun. I'm old. Grandpa's old too, and he still has fun. Always <laughs> laugh and never And how cry. right I was! Every Grandpa was having fun dancing with Miss Smiley. The sun starts shining in the sky. <laughs> Back at the mill, we were going to do a show with Elsie's Toy Theatre to cheer Charlie up. And Miss Smiley brought Grandpa home. Is cheery Charlie Cheeks to here? Yes, but he's miserable. Grandpa, we can't cheer him up. Well, we'll soon see about that. And upstairs went Grandpa to see if he could cheer Charlie up. The slipper fits. I'm going to be a princess. I'm going to live in the palace. 
I'm going to have lots of lovely clothes. Elsie, that's not how it goes. <clears throat> so Prince Charming found his princess and he and Cinderella lived happily, happily ever after. The end. Oh, bravo, very good, magical. Hello, Charlie. Oh. It's lovely to meet you. I'm a big fan, you know, perhaps your greatest. Oh, look at this. Just like you were. Oh, you make my heart go pitty pitty pat. Just like that. Pitty pitty. I can't do it anymore. I, I can't even remember how it felt. The, the theatre has no magic for me now. I think I'll go and have a rest. I'm too old to have fun. You're never too old to have fun. Never. And I think I can remind him of the fun he used to have. But I'm going to need this. Not, not the shrinking cap, Grandpa! Catch me if you can! When our Grandpa shrinks, he can get up to all kinds of tricks. And his magic can make things go. And sometimes he dresses up as something... Captain Dumbledore! ...to save the day. For the rescue! Which is what he'd done today. He'd dressed up in the Charlie Cheekster doll's clothes. Now, here's the plan, Elsie. I'm going to need your theatre. OK. The song... Charlie was lying on his bed trying to sing. When the dark cloud... Oh, I can't do it. When I knocked on the door. Come in if you must. Oh, hello, Elsie. We thought you might like to have this in here. Maybe the magic of the theatre will start to work for you again. Thank you. You're very sweet. And I left Grandpa to carry out his plan. The... The rain clouds... Uh, the dark clouds are so... Um, oh, I'm too old. But then this happened. You're never too old to do what you want to do, do what you did when you were young. Don't long for your youth when you're long in the tooth, just get done with having fun. Oh, the magic of the theatre, the smell of the grease paint, the audience applause, the magic of the theatre can still, can still be yours. That's amazing. It's me. It's me how I used to be. And how you can still be if you want to. You're never too old to be who you want to be, be who you were so long ago. Remember the times when you stood on the stage and waited for the start of the show? Oh, the magic of the theatre, the smell of the grease paint, the audience applause, the magic of the theatre can still, can still be yours. Oh, the birds singing. Are you singing? Is it Charlie? It's Charlie singing. Oh, what's that? What's that singing? It's Charlie! When the dark clouds are forming and the rain pours down, don't get sad. Just let your sorrows drown, cause the clouds will pass and take away your frown and the sun will start shining in the sky. You've cheered up, Charlie. Totally. The sun's come out. All together now. Yes. Always smile when the sun is shining. Always laugh and never cry. Every cloud has a silver lining when the sun starts shining in the sky. into our costumes for Miss Smiley's summer show. I picked up the doll and Grandpa's clothes and went to rescue him. Soon we were all singing in the meadow. Always laugh and never cry. Every cloud has a silver lining when the sun starts shining in the sky. Oh, surely Grandpa hasn't gone for a lie down. I must wake him. No, Charlie's going to sing your favourite. This is how it'll always be. 
You're the only thing I see. I'll get down on bended knee and tell you that you're the one for me. Oh, you, you make, make my heart go pity pity. Soon, Grandpa was back in his own clothes. Cup off, Grandpa, quick! We have to hurry. They're all singing in the meadow. Right. Always smile when the sun is shining. Always laugh and never cry. Every cloud has a silver lining when the sun starts shining in the sky. It's the magic of the theatre. The smell of the grease paint, the audience applause. The magic of the theatre can still, can still be yours. Oh, the magic of the theatre. The sound of the music, the lights that shine Yes, the magic of the theatre Can still, can still be mine <laughs> I can still do it, I can You can, Charlie oh. I ran to give him his doll Well, we did it Yep, yeah, teamwork, that's what I call it Teamwork Teamwork <laughs> But how did you manage to remember what it was like, Charlie? Well, you may not believe this, but the magic of the theatre worked. And this little doll came to life. He was singing and dancing, just like I used to do. The doll came to life, Grandpa. Extraordinary. Crazy. Hilarious. Ridiculous. Risky. <laughs> Turn the world hairy Oh, how tricky We ran out of spells in our hairy fairy tree But they don't care They, they love, love to be hairy The ha ha fairies Finding all the laughter in hairy land Ma ha And Minnie And don't forget there's Nana And Chihuahua the hairy pet But up on the hill in Chateau Shampoo There's Boris Boo Hoo And Boise too Boris is trouble, you wait and see. But they don't care, they love to be hairy. Wiggy wants a new dress. Yes, a yellow one with sparkles and frilly bits and everything. Mm. <laughs> if only we hadn't run out of magic. Oh, I know. I could have just magicked up a dress and it would have appeared. Poof! Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle! Oh. Oh. Never mind, Wiggy. You look lovely just as you are. But it's a bit... Boring wearing the same thing every, every day. Oh, remember that time Boris Boohoo got bored with his disguises? <gasps> I do, I do. That was so funny. <laughs> Listen, one bright sunny day, we were flying around Hairyland looking for an adventure. Picky, popper, picky, 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 me round Hairyland. Round Hairyland. I am quick. And I am wiggy. We're the hairy fair. Ha-ha had been shopping in Hairy Town. We landed in the hairy pear tree Whoa. just in time to see what they'd bought. Yeah. Lots yeah. and lots of lovely costumes. Because Minnie was putting on a dance show. <laughs> well, you know what Minnie Ha-ha's like. She just loves dancing. Minnie Ha-ha, she is so fantastic. Minnie Ha-ha, she is 
is so gymnastic. Watch her go, go, stretch. She has elastic. Hopping, leaping, skipping, jumping. Careful, Minnie, mind the bumping, Minnie. Oh, Minnie, ha, ha! There was netting and feathers and sparkles and lots of hairy stuff, of course. Everyone started dancing and prancing about, especially pa -ha, ha Because this was the day for dancing and prancing. But up on the hill at Chateau Shampoo, someone was bored. Can you guess who? Boris Boo-Hoo, what's he gonna do, who? Boris was looking at his disguises. Hats, cloaks, jackets, trousers, beards, moustaches and lots of terrible wigs. And he was bored with all of them. Bored, bored, bored. Just then, Boris heard the sound of laughter rising from the valley. He picked up his hairy starey. And he saw the Ha Ha Hairies dancing and practicing. He thought they looked very silly. <laughs> Boris Boohoo would never make a fool of himself like that. Then he saw Ma and Nana taking the costumes into the house. And he had an idea. Those costumes would make fantastic new disguises. And he was bored of his disguises. But how could he get hold of them? Boris needed a plan. Boris needs a plan, a plan. He needs a plan as quick as he can. He needs a plan, he needs it quick. He needs to plan a clever trick. What'll it be? What'll it be? What'll it be? And the plan was this. Boris was going to get Boise to join the dance show. And while they were all busy practicing the dancing, Boris was going to take all the costumes. Back at the Ha Ha Harry's house, Ma was fixing Nana's costume. <coughs> Nana was very pleased with it. She couldn't wait to get dancing. <laughs> and outside, Minnie was teaching Pa some steps for a hairy ballet. I can do that thing with your leg in the air. Look, Chris. Uh, Wiggy, what did I say? Uh, <laughs> ow. Shush. Just then, Boris and Boise turned up. Boise saw Minnie and bumped into Boris. Pa was really pleased to see Boris. But Chihuahua wasn't. He knew that Boris was probably up to something. And he was right. Boris asked if Boise could join Minnie's dance show. <laughs> and of course, Minnie said, yes! <laughs> then Pa asked if Boris wanted to join in too. But Boris said he was far too busy for dancing and prancing. Far too busy. Boris had to get Ma and Nana out of the house. So he said Boise needed a costume. <laughs> of course, Boise needed a costume. Pa went to get Ma and Nana. You okay, Wiggy? No, I've got a bruise right on my bottom. <laughs> What's so funny about the word bottom? <laughs> Nana was so pleased to see Boris. But Boris wanted to get into the house to find the other costumes. So he asked her to see to Boise's costume. <laughs> then he waved goodbye. <laughs> but as soon as he saw they were all busy with Boise, he did this. He grabbed as many costumes as he could carry and was about to leave when he saw Boise and Minnie in their costumes about to practice their dance. So Boris had to wait. <laughs> Having a friend means being together. That's 
what friends are for. Having a friend means doing whatever. That's what friends are for. So come along, come play with me. Take my hand and stay with me. Spend your every day with me. That's what friends are for. <laughs> Very best friends are like sister and brother. That's what friends are for. So come along, come play with me. Take my hand and stay with me. Spend your every day with me. That's what friends are for. That's what friends are for. That's what friends are for. <laughs> At last it was Boris's chance. While everyone was saying well done to Boise and Minnie, he tippy-toed across the garden and hid behind the bumblebee bush. Did you did, did you did you see that? Yeah, but it's okay, Wiggy, because Chihuahua saw it too. Yes! Chihuahua had seen Boris and he wasn't going to let him get away with it. He barked and Boris nearly jumped out of his skin. When the Ha-Ha Harry saw Boris with the rest of the costumes, they thought he wanted to be in the dance show too. And of course he could wear the tutu. <laughs> Boris Boohoo in a tutu Boris Boohoo in a tutu All right, will you calm down or you'll fall over again? <laughs> Soon everyone was in their costumes It was time for the hairy ballet to begin Boris hadn't managed to get hold of any new disguises after all. And he'd ended up in a ballet. And it served him right. Ooh. Oh, I loved that hairy ballet. Boris was hilarious. Oh, remember that spinny thing they did, Quiff? Oh. I can do that. Look. Whee. Uh, no, Wiggy. No! Stop! Whoa. 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 Oh, sorry. Did you hurt your bottom? <laughs> yes, as a matter of fact, I did. Oh, poor Quiff. You hurt your bottom! <laughs> Wiggy, there's nothing wrong with the word bottom. <laughs> 